Hi everybody, it's Jules here and I'm going to do an outfit of the day slash night slash haul for you. Um, I'm wearing this today in the daytime, but I'm also going to wear it at night. Um, we're having my one sister-in-law over and her fiance and we're going to have dinner. And then we're all going to go to my other sister-in-law's um, play at her university. She's just involved with that. So this is what I came up with. This outfit, it was like, it made sense in my head and then when I put it together I wasn't too sure, but I decided to just go with it anyway and whatever, I'll see how I feel about it next time. Um, so this is um, just a warm eye look that I created, I don't know, just some mauves and browns, uh, neutral lip, I'm wearing my nautical knot earrings and then my twisted um, black rope and knotted necklace thing from Forever 21. Um, this is a shirt I got a really, 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 really long time ago from Winners, but I think it originally was a Levi's line, um, and they're Andy Warhol butterflies, so it was just so cool that I didn't want to throw it out. Uh, and then I paired it with the cardigan from Forever 21 with the um, pearl button detailing. I just have a watch and, oops, I forgot one of my rings. Um, oh, this is such a cool little ring I discovered. I forgot I had, um, I don't know, I like pinky rings and this is just like a little turquoise heart within a heart. I just thought it was really cute. Um, so then I have this Betsy Johnson belt that I also got at Winners once and it's cool because it's adjustable. So it could be a waist or a hip belt, um, but I chose to wear it on my waist. This skirt I got from Winners and it's actually American Apparel which I thought was pretty cool. So it's like totally tiered and really flowy, which I liked. And then I'm just wearing some sheer black tights with it. And I'll probably um, wear my little ankle boots. Uh, it's a little bit too cold for flats and it's not gonna, I'll probably wear the boots while I still can. My hair's crazy today. I don't really know how I feel about this crazy hair. So for the haul, I was at the grocery store and uh, there was like a table where things were 94 cents. Such a random price, I don't really know why they were so cheap, but they had um, Joe Fresh Cosmetics and Joe Fresh is a line here in Canada and it's part of the grocery store. It's like under the umbrella of the grocery store, but they have clothes and cosmetics and um, I think that's it, shoes, stuff like that. So um, I picked up this nail color. This was not part of the 94 cent. This was a couple days before. Um, it's in the color Aqua and I got it to touch up my pumps that I had scuffed. I don't know if I had mentioned this in um, my last favorites video, but I got these um, if in early February for a wedding and then uh, I scuffed them and I wanted, and like was showing white through. So I got this nail polish and it's not an ideal match, but I thought it was pretty good. You can't really tell. So I was happy with that. So I ended up getting that. Then, sorry, back to that 94 cent table. I picked up this cream shadow and it's in the color sugar and it's just really neutral. And I'm glad this was only 94 cents because cream shadows are never great with me. They crease within like an hour. Um, but that's just a pretty color. Um, I just layer, I put it underneath and I layer on top basically is how I use that. And then I picked up this tinted lip balm in the color blush. Again, 94 cents, couldn't believe it. Um, packaging's nice. When I looked at it, I felt weird, but I realized that dot is like the moisture or whatever. And it's like a really pretty corally color. And it actually is a really nice formula. It's really shiny and I'm happy with that. I can't believe it was only 94 cents. Uh, then on a separate trip, oh, I'm going all over the place. Same day I picked up this. Um, I got this floral shirt. This was, I think $20, $19. And it's just a flowy shirt. With this nice pattern and the back is just like a plain t-shirt. And then the, this part is um, kind of like a blouse material. So I thought that was really, really pretty. Well, I ended up at Anthropology, and it's still um, a pretty big deal here. I think there's only two stores in Ontario. So um, it's pretty expensive. Is it as expensive in America? Because I have a hard time adjusting to the prices. Even all the sale stuff, it's like minimum $50. So I picked up this dress for $60, which I think is a lot. So it is this blue cotton dress. I was worried at first that it looked too jean-like, but it's not. It's just like a comfy material. It's like a long short sleeve um, and has all these nice stitchings to create a fitted look and the bottom flares out like that. And then the back is just plain as well with the, the stitching and then the flare. So I just, I really liked it. I thought it looked great with my eyes. How do my eyes look? 
And it's great with a belt. I wore a little um, woven belt with it, and I even put a cardigan on top, and I just hope I get a lot of wear out of this because it was pretty expensive. I just have a hard time spending a lot on clothes. So, so that is all for my look and my haul. Thank you all so much for watching, and we'll catch you next time. Take care.